If you're new to this channel, you might not know, but my A4 Quattro over here is smoking. So I have about three theories why she might be smoking. So recently I changed the PCV valve over here. So I thought maybe it is broken from the manufacturer, sending all the crankcase pressure with some oil particles straight into the intake going into the combustion chamber. So that could be one of the reasons why she smokes. So obviously I went ahead, I unplugged both sides. I tried to feel if there was oil in there and she was clean. So it can't be the PCV valve. So the second thing I thought what it could be might be my injectors which is actually sitting below the intake manifold which is this one over here. Reason why I say so is you can go ahead and google it as injectors does make your car smoke white and black. So my third theory what it could be which I actually think it might be is the piston ring. So the B8 specifically this model has got a piston ring problem. So for curiosity I'm just gonna take the boroscope that I got check out inside the pistons and see what we have got. So while the laptop is booting up I just want to show you guys something here as well. So these are the order that I took them out. So the first spark plug, second, third and fourth. So really by looking at it do you guys notice something? Look at this threads most specially. Let's see if I can just zoom in. Come on, focus. Okay, if you look at the threads, it's clean, dirty, dirty, clean. So already that tells me that I think the problem might be by cylinder two and three. But once we go down there, we will have a better look. So now we're going over to spark plug number one. Oh my goodness, look at how dirty that is. Okay, I mean, I can't even see any silver. Okay, let's go over to spark plug number two. Okay, that is also super duper dirty. It actually looks a little bit cleaner than I thought it would. Okay, so let's go over to number three. Okay, and moving over to number four. Holy goodness. Okay, so it actually looks like spark plug number one and spark plug number four is the problem. And also don't buy this boroscope that I'm gonna link in the description. It is absolutely bad because we have got normal rubber over here. So what happened is as soon as your engine is hot and you're trying to slide this thing down, it's gonna damage the wiring. Also, it doesn't wanna bend straight. So I had to actually duct tape it to a stick in order to get it down there straight. So this thing is such a headache. So in general, I must say all four spark plugs is very very dirty But number one and number four were the worst for some reason So I, I don't know why there is if that is oil or fuel. Maybe if I do take a sniff at it No, that smells like oil So I, I think it might be my rings that has went But one thing that I'm gonna try to check out is I'm gonna take my old spark plugs that I do have so when I did bought this car before I did the first service, I still have got those spark plugs, I still have got those coils. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to replace them instead of using these again. I just want to see out of curiosity what is going to happen. It could be that one of these spark plugs over here or even the coil pack cannot take the new software. So it is worth a shot just to try it out. The spark plugs is double platinum for the people that has wondered. And also these are the R8 coils. Well, that is what I say. But once I did some research, it was supposed to say some kind of Audi emblem there and it doesn't. So for all I know, these ones might not even be suitable for this car. So I'm gonna go ahead place the old coils and spark plugs back and just see what happens. Maybe one of the best things I can also do is do a piston compression test. I mean if piston 1, 4, 2 and 3 they do not display the same pressure I do know that those cylinders might have a problem. In this case it looks like cylinder 1 and cylinder 4 might be the biggest problem. 2 and 3 actually looks kind of clean which is very weird according to those spark plugs. But anyway guys I think I'll do the compression test next because the spark plugs is already out and then also i will be placing in the new spark plugs and coils so anyway thank you so much for watching i really do appreciate it. if you guys did enjoy this video make sure to drop a big like
like. If you love support the channel, hit the logo at the bottom right corner to subscribe. If you want to see a similar video, hit the icons on the screen. And I'll see all of you legends in my next video. But for now, peace out.